Hey everybody and welcome back to another episode of Call of Cthulhu. This is your host Callan Hale here. So why don't you sit back, relax, grab your favorite beverage, grab your favorite snack, turn out the lights, throw in your headphones, and get ready for some spooky. We are almost done with Call of Cthulhu, which uh, surprises me. Honestly, I thought this would be a longer game. I thought it was only about eight hours, so that should catch us up. I hope you're all doing well. Uh, we got uh, chapter 13 and 14 to go through. And let's read this before into the madness. Pierce crosses the dots where old acquaintances and new faces met their ends. All over the place, Leviathan slaves were wandering in search of a victim. After fighting his way through, and after discovering the truth about the origin of the cult and its founders, Pierce family reached a whaling station. He hopes to get there before she does something. Uh, last episode, we did catch Sarah. Uh, let's see. My Xbox controller was using his dying. That's in my PS4 controller at the moment. Who is this? The quest for truth requires sacrifice. There's no room for compassion. Who's there? Your stubbornness of wanting to help others who would have deserted you is a weakness. Fate leads us inevitably to policy, and in one's final moments, one is always alone. You can't escape it forever. It will always find its way. Damn it! Um... That, that is a cultist, I think. Check on Pierce in a second. I forgot to start my timer. Sanity levels. The true appearance of Leviathan was revealed, and no man can support this vision without going mad. Pierce sets his eyes upon this cosmic being, and his mind suffers a new attack. He is trapped in the whaling station with Leviathan, and thus under a series of ordeals if he is to survive this encounter. His choices will be serious. Will bear serious consequences on his sanity. Learn to obey. Oh no. Ah, finally awake. How do you feel, Mr. Pierce? Uh, Fuller, son of a bitch, I'll kill you. No, I'm not even really with you. Well, to be perfectly precise, I am with you, but not in this cell. What have you done to me? Me? Nothing, really. See, it's one of the exquisite effects of this incredible creature. Uh, Leviathan! I see you already know about it. Well, shall we begin? I said, don't. He does it anyway. Ah. Uh, look, the more I resist. Let me take a sample from you. Flesh, blood, spinal fluids. Don't fear. 
I created the mythological Ankor from Leviathan's flesh. Who knows what I can make with you? I need your body for my research. Killed him. Unnecessary sacrifice that proves your determination. Oh no. Sanity. Here seems to revolve in shot following doing so he followed the wish of the Leviathan. I didn't mean to do that, I don't think. Fuller is dead. I have I had I'd have great difficulty explaining what exactly happened. We're really no longer of this world, that's for sure. And in a confused way, I know that Leviathan forced me to kill him. He did not hide that fact that he wanted his death. Find the truth and be free. Nothing's happening. Uh, I played another game that had some kind of, some Cthulhu-ish feels to it. Whoa, I saw it. Uh, it was, I think, the Chernobyl Protocol. Whoa. All right. No. Or Chernobylite. That was it. Really good game, from what I remember. I didn't play much of it. Nope. Nope. <laughs> Do I go down this middle path? No, nope, I don't. Okay, so I go down the first path? No. Do it change every time? Hmm. It's this path on this way. Nope. Okay. So this path, then no. Oh, I was hoping I could, uh, put my lantern there. I'll go this way, then this way. Okay. This way. Okay, getting closer. Go this way, that way, that way, that way, this way. Because the only way you can go. Shit in the kid with after. But I thought he kind of had it coming personally for the crap he did.
Nope. Let me see if it opened up this way. And it did not. Okay. I'm going to pull the lever. Nothing's happening. Nothing's happening. Hmm. Interesting little puzzle we got going on here. Play this way, hand back. So the first one did nothing. Let's try the last one. Nope. Second one. Nope. Okay. Let's try the third one then. That's our last option. But if you are enjoying this, please leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe. If any of your friends are interested in some Call of Cthulhu action, share with your friends. I'll be uploading this on the um, Retro Gaming Palace once this is complete. Probably just do weekly releases. Just one trip this week, every Wednesday. I'm trying to diversify a little bit uh, since uh, Twitter is a not going to be a place. I'll see you here this time. Must have to run through the fuck. Oh, come on, move. Okay, I don't know what happened there. My control just laughed. Okay, let's try this one more time. I 
I don't know why the controls keep locking on me. Let me let me coach. Uh, okay, let's try this one more time. This level and why my controls are going really hard. Oh, check something real quick. The settings, game, subtitles, control, gamepad. Yeah, that's Crouch. Why is that when you crouch? I don't know. Unless I'm supposed to find another way around? Oh. I was. Okay. Pierce finally met Leviathan in flesh and blood. The monstrous creature submitted him to a series of ordeals, at the end of which he decided that the detective was ready to face his destiny. Pierce built the whaling station, and after a final confrontation with Leviathan, he passed it. 
This episode might be a bit long because this is the last chapter. I kind of want to see if I can finish it. Actually, I am going to make chapter 14 its own chapter. I can't hear the voice anymore. <laughs> so, I'm going to end this recording here. And it, as always, I have been your host, Challen Hale. Hydrate, medicate if you got to, eat some good food. Be kind to yourselves, be kind to each other. The chapter 14, I believe, is the last chapter, so that might be the last episode of Call of Cthulhu. So I hope I see y'all next time. If you enjoy, please leave a like, leave a comment. Thank you all for hanging out. I will see you in the next episode of Call of Cthulhu.